Hello Internet people! So, you might be wondering, what is HTTPS definition and why do you see this green padlock in the top of your browser? In this video, I'll answer these questions and also why should you care about HTTPS and how to get one. Also, find out how HTTPS could help Jon Snow. Tip sweat punch. Alright, so what is HTTPS? HTTPS stands for Hypertext Transfer Protocol Secure. Hypertext is just a text that contains links to other text. In other words, HTTPS is an encrypted and secure variation of HTTP. If you want to learn more about HTTP, check out the video that appears on your screen now. Compared to HTTP, HTTPS has added layer of security as it connects through secure socket layer, so SSL or transport layer security, TLS. And people are very sensitive. I know, I know. But in this case, HTTPS is actually really used for protocol. Why should you care about HTTPS? Not only does HTTPS enable secure data transfer, but because of this, Google likes it. Starting from 2014, Google announced that having an SSL certificate installed on your website will increase your ranking position. And if you don't have it, your users might see this screen on your site. Scary stuff, right? Well, you might be asking, how does HTTPS work? This is usually achieved with SSL certificate, which is like an ID which has been verified by central authority. Here's a technical example. Let's say Jon Snow sends a raven to Lannisters, but the people of the North intercept it. And to use the right terminology, Jon Snow is the client and Lannisters are the server and the people of the North are fishing. So they are trying to get sensitive information out of the data transfer. If this was the case for HTTP, the message would say something like this. However, if the message was sent using HTTPS, the message would look like this. So the people of the North can't understand it, but Lannisters have a decryption key so they can read it. So when the data leaves your computer, it's encrypted and decrypted on the receiver's end and vice versa. This is really useful when you're filling in online forms, for example, credit card information. And if your information is encrypted, then nobody can hijack that information and use it. Like this guy. All your base are belong to us. My name is Robert, and if you're trying to master the digital world while getting entertained, this is the channel for you. So hit that subscribe button and click on the bell so that you get notified whenever there's a new video. So how do you get HTTPS? Well, actually, as mentioned before, you need SSL certificate to get the HTTPS. And for this, you can either uh, choose paid version or a free version of SSL certificate. Why would you pay for SSL certificate if there's a free one? The biggest difference is that free SSL certificate confirms that you own the domain. It doesn't know who are you and if you are who you claim to be. You are not you, you're me. On the other hand, the paid SSL certificate providers verify your domain and that you are who you claim to be. So you have to provide proof to them. Here's an example of free SSL and paid one. On the left, you see that the free one has a little bit less information, whereas the one on the right, you have more information about the owner. If you're running a small site or a blog, then don't worry about the paid SSL certificate. Instead, if you're starting to gain a lot of momentum and you have e-commerce functionalities, then you should consider switching to a paid version. If you found this video useful, hit the like button and let me know if you have any questions down below. If you're looking to install free SSL certificate, check out the top video and you'll have HTTPS in 7 minutes. If you want to learn more about SSL certificate, check out the bottom video where I explain it in more detail. Whoosh! All your base belong to us.